Hello everyone and welcome to the unboxing and review video of the Dell Inspiron 14R with Intel processor i5, 1 terabyte of memory, and um, 8 gigabytes of RAM. Alrighty. Ah, there it is. Slide down flat. Oh yes, always good with the packaging. Okay, here is the computer itself. Right up there. We'll look at the other stuff in the box in a second. This is really what you want to see. Put that off the side. Okay, here's the computer. First impression, I really like it. Everything looks really well organized compared to my old HP. Let's open it up. Well, it helped if I had it on the right side. Perfect. Basically, exactly the way. Oh, oh hello. Uh, um, the, exactly the way um, it looked when I got it, or when I looked at it before at the store. There's a touch screen right there. All very nice moon finish. You turn around there. You can look at that. You can see you have an HDMI, Ethernet, uh, USB, and headset and uh, headphones port there, and HDMI and the vents. And uh, see that port right there? I think that's safety card or something. Let's turn it over to the other side. This is very lightweight actually, only about 5 pounds. Um, there's another port right there, there's the optical drive, DVD optical drive. And this does come with a HD, my camera keeps going down, this comes with an HD webcam, great for video calling. Okay, let's look and see all this other stuff that's in the box. This is the power. Very nice long cord. Nice battery. So we'll plug the computer up in a second. And really, there's only a few more things in here. A uh, quick start guide, warranty, safety, information. Now what we are going to do is we are going to plug the computer up um, and then after that I'll power it up and you can see what it looks like on there and we'll continue with the review. Hello everyone, welcome back. So we were able to charge the, um, the device, the, we were able to charge the computer and one thing I have to say is this battery on other computers, on my old computer if you had the battery on there for a long time, it really did heat up. This is barely warm. You could barely tell that this is that this has been used. Now, this is the first time I've ever set up a Windows 8, but it'll also be good as a reviewing point because to see how easy it is to review or to set up a Windows 8. So there it is. There's a beautiful Dell once again. There's the beautiful camera filming the Dell. And now we're going to hit the magical power on button. Here we go. Power on. There we go. Now, there's the nice Dell logo. And as you can see, the computer's working. It is turning on for the first time. The beast has started. Okay, the screen finally came up. United States, English, US, next. Okay. Saving your, your settings. That was easy. License terms. Okay, yes, they want you to read all that. I accept these terms for Windows and this PC. Pick. Okay, email address. After you put your emails in, let's see. Let's go through this. Personalize your PC name. Okay, um, this is going to be. Karsten, 
for my name. Background color. Uh, that's a little, you know. Yeah, that's nice. We'll just go with that. How about it? Next, wireless. Okay, so basically, you go through your wireless here. Okay, so I had to create a Microsoft account. Skimming through all that because this is my first Windows 8 computer. Now it's creating the account, finalizing your settings, or my settings, I guess you could say, since I was the one actually making the account. Uh, would you look at that? It's done. Okay, so let's just explore this a little bit, shall we? Um, start, start button. I like this because one of the things about Windows 8 that I wasn't sure about or I wasn't aware of until I found this out was you can download apps off of Windows 8. Apps because there there have been computer uh, there have been apps on on phones that I would like to have on my computer, but you can't do that. But now you can. Okay, desktop looks nice. Really nice desktop. Okay. Well, it looks like it's pretty much all set up. I'm going to experiment with this now, but so far this computer has been a really well-running computer for the short time I've had it. Now, if you listen to this, you can really barely even hear the fan running. Which means it's a very good high-performance computer. Now, um, this is a 1 terabyte computer, um, 8 gigs of RAM really high RAM, uh, Intel processor i5, optical drive, um, let's see, touch screen, uh, aluminum finish, waves, max audio, I mean, just, you know, it's, it's, it's good stuff. But thank you guys for watching, um, as for now, the computer's running great, nice design, I'd give it at least a 9 out of 10, um, at least for right now, um, you're ahead of time. Don't know how it will work, don't know how it will do when I edit stuff. But, um, I definitely like Dell more than HP. I was the only one in my family that had an HP, and that did not work good. One year computer, and had all my files on it. Still working to get those files off. Thank you guys for watching, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. I will try my best to answer them. Thanks for watching. Bye.